All right, chemistry homework. I'm going to put my name on it. All right, so cation anion synthesis. Protect the volume of the product. Oh, this is the same as the homework that we did the other day. Okay, what do I need? Oh, I need that, like, reference thing. Where's my binder? Oh, there's my binder. Okay. I need this thing. Uh, all right, because that is, oh, where's my notes page? Here's my notes page. So we have this on the notes. Uh, synthesis, A plus B. So I had this. Oh, yeah, that's right. The things had to add up to zero. Okay. So I'm going to set that there. Uh, all right. Strontium bromine. Where's strontium's there. So that's group two. So that's two plus. And then bromine is there. That's group 17. Da, 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 minus. So there was that flip the numbers trick. So S R B R two. Um, let's see, aluminum three plus. Uh, S oh, that's one of those thingies. Uh, go to my binder. This is that page. Okay, here's that page. Um, S O four. Two minus. I'll put those there because those go together. Two minus. So I the numbers. So A L two, and then we did one of those. Go back and look at that other homework. The last one we did. Where is it? Oh yeah, that's right. You put it in parentheses. Okay. Let's see here. So four, three, and then B A is there. That's another. Oh, that's the same thing as strontium. So that's two plus oxygen. Uh, two minus. No, that's they're the same. Okay. Oxidation numbers of transition metals. Transition metals. Uh, uh, all right, so that's oxidation numbers. Oxidation numbers are these things. So one plus two plus whatever. So uh, transition metal cation. What was the cation again? Uh, oh, positive. Cats are positive. That's right. Um, so they've got to be positive. So plus, plus, plus. What's the transition metal? What is a transition metal? Transition metals. There's a picture. Oh. Here. Okay. Oh, there's one. Like. Yeah, there's iron. So iron's in the middle. And so um, transition metals and poor metals varies, variable. Okay, use the oxidation number of the anion. So nitrogen, nitrogen's negative. So that's an anion. And it says it's three minus. So this was two plus two minus. So that must be, oh, that's right. The notes here. Um, here. For a neutral compound, the oxidation numbers of each atom must add up to zero. Okay, so if nitrogen's a three minus, then iron must be a three plus. 
sulfur, what was sulfur? Two minus, what do you do with that? Two. What do you do with that two? Oh, okay, so, oh, you have to take that and take it times two. All right, so then that's times two, which is negative four, and so that means it has to be four plus. Okay, four plus, and then, okay, then um, we got four plus, and then C two, CO three, now oh, CO3 is one of those things, CO3 is a two minus, so this must be the same thing. Um, two of scanniums. So how, how do we do that in class? Do that, oh, so, so, Two times something equals two minus. Okay, that must be one plus. Okay. Uh, all right. Cool. And then the last piece. Da, da, da. Oh, I remembered. I was confused on these. Let's see here. Right and up pulls electrons. That's the one that keeps to stay in anion. So which one? Let's just start with right and up. So fluorine is to the right, so it gets to do its thing. And then for the cation, this is a part I didn't quite get. Uh, let me work backwards on this. Nitrogen. Oh, that looks too complicated. Oh, there's a video. Oh, I see what it's doing, so Maybe if I draw that, so N one, two, let's go back here. N one, two, three, four, five, remember that thing? Fluorine, one, two, three, five, six, seven. So it could take one, which would leave four. So that's two pairs. So N F. And if there were Two more, that was the example that he did that would leave a pair that's NF3. And there's one more blank here, so I gotta come up with one more. Well, if that's one, then that's three. My guess is this is five, so that would take the rest of them. So NF5. Let me try doing the same thing with this one bromine. Bromine. Oh, that's a group. 17 again, so that's so that should be the same as fluorine. But sulfur has six, so if I do that little thing one, two, three, four, five, six, I mean, one, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven. So it takes one, but that's going to leave an odd number. This is like, they always have to leave like an even number. So it's going to take two. Yeah. Maybe I'll write it in the same order. Be R2 or four. There's a pattern here, two, four, six. And then chlorine is, these are all halogens. Um, then carbon has four. So, one, two, three, seven. So, I'm going to have to have at least two, or then I can have four. Okay. Uh, the, all right, seems good. Correct my name. All right, there we go.